Hey guys, I'm just here to let you know that this is part two of a two-part video. So if you haven't seen the first part, you'll likely be confused. So go ahead and watch that on the same channel. Click that video and it'll catch you right up. Okay, thanks for the rest of you. What's that noise? Yep, okay, got you. All right, let me just, okay, I'll just write that down. Right. Bear with me for a second here. Your order is definitely down on paper. So yeah, I hope that gets to you. Talk soon. I wish I couldn't see that. Very funny, dude. It's called arm day. And admittedly, yeah, I went a little bit too hard and I can't move my arms anymore. But I am still a good friend, so despite your rudeness, I have brewed you this artisanal pot of coffee in our finest china. So how do you feel about that? <laughs> Fuck! I'm sorry! Hey John, get a pair of scissors. Uh, not on me. I think there's some in that drawer back there. Hold on. Uh... Oh, oh my god! god! What the hell? I don't know, man. I, I just swear to god, I just tried to open the drawer. I, I don't know my own strength anymore. It's working. I'm getting more powerful. And there you go. But I asked for scissors. Ask, ask, ask. It's all you're doing. You died. Can I have this? Can I have that? How about you consider others for once? Okay, my mentor today is Regis Philbin. Now, I don't know what makes Regis Philbin a fitness instructor, but I do know he was on Who Wants to Be a Millionaire and at least one morning show with someone named Kathy Lee. So, it's qualified in my book. Hi everybody, I'm Regis Philbin. Welcome to my personal workout. You know, it wasn't until I had my blocked artery that maybe you heard about this year. I never jogged, I never walked, I never took that seriously. I never jogged, I never walked, my muscles, frankly, atrophied. That is, until the valve bust. And that's when I decided to take up walking. And can I tell you something? I love it. All right, we're not all out here exercising like a rock, but uh, surely you've uh, you know taken a, a brisk walk around the corner before, Regis, no? And can I tell you something? I love it. How's your walk on stage to be a, who wants to be a millionaire? You liar, I seen you walk. It's unbelievable, I just woke up this morning, They've, they sprouted out of my torso or something. I can't believe what I'm, what I'm doing, what I'm feeling. Not only that, I feel terrific. I think I have more stamina, more endurance. I think I have more stamina, I think. I'm not really sure. The blockage to my heart blocks most feelings, most nerves. Call Our security, own who Kathy? that reaches in. <laughs> Still going at the 4.5 miles an hour, and mm -hmm. you just use your arms when it's comfortable to. Sure, it's a high you can't buy anywhere, isn't it? Well, I don't know about that. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know about that, Kathy says. I don't know about that. Regis, have you, have, you, have you ever been to Bleecker Street? Okay, they're selling some pretty good stuff down there. Does a little more for you than a, than, a, than a brisk jog. I must admit, I haven't raised my elbows, you know, this high, but I can see the, the benefits to it. Yeah. That's great. <laughs> what? Regis, why don't we just start with what you have done before? You should have just called this thing Regis Philbin learning to be human again after an extended cryo sleep. All right, good. This man did a whole workout tape on walking, just walking. For the most of us, the legs, uh, we've evolved them to, you know, do, get, get us places. We don't all have uh, personal helicopters that just, uh, you know, take us from our house to our place of employment like you do. That's great that you do. Gave you a blockage. Just get a position like this, go down into this stretch, and again. get started. Come on, right now, all right? You're gonna be up, you're gonna be strong. You're gonna be ready for anything. Can't guarantee you'll get your own morning show. I can't guarantee you're gonna be successful, receive anything in life, 
receive any compensation for what you do, but you'll feel like you did this for a minute. You'll feel like that for sure. I guarantee this. This part's guaranteed. At what point do I start getting my heart beat up? What's going on, my dudes? Looking a bit puny today, but I hardly blame you. Takes a lot of, you know, work and gusto and dedication to get a body like that, you know what I'm saying? Not everyone's got the time. Oh. See you guys later. You insulted me just now. You insulted me once, but it was a really hurtful insult. I gotta admit, guys, his ego's gotten as big as his biceps. I still haven't got my scissors yet. Climate change is real, and this is not a point of dispute or controversy. Oh, that is true. That's objective fact as seen in this graph charting the data from three independent institutes. So John thinks he can get all high and mighty on us, huh? Let's see how he likes this. Let's make this fatty fat again. Hey man, I need to take this to Delivery for John? I don't remember ordering anything. You guys must take me for a real fool. You think I wouldn't notice this? That's right. I know what you've done. You sent me this bag of nuggets to trick me into gaining all my weight back, which I did, by the way, after eating only one of them. I'm a bit confused. Oh, shit. I can't believe you dudes, dude. I thought you were my dudes. We may have been a little too harsh. So you hear anything? I hear something, but I don't know what the hell he's doing. Sorry guys. The dream is dead. I've been betrayed. Ultimately, my gains were actually my losses. Okay, you ready? You signed his bitches. It's not good you do this to me. You know what I mean? You're laughing still. I know, dude. We're sorry. You fucking came in here to apologize and you're laughing at me still? No, man. You can be skinny one day. I, I know it. You don't want to see me suffer? No, man. What the heck do I do about it? You need to get up on your feet and you need to smash this glass. You, I told you to tell me earlier in this episode to do that, didn't I? Yes, you did. I'm reminding you now. Son, it's me, your late father, your dadums, your papa. If you find this, it must mean you're really in need of some encouraging words. I just want you to know that I love you so very much. And I know that deep down you can achieve anything if you put your mind to it. Don't give up on your dreams, son. Make your pappy proud. Love, Dad. That's weird. Why is this letter from my dad stapled to my Marky Mark VHS? Oh my god. It's Marky Mark. Pa! Yeah, and what would he say, John? Well, he'd be likely to say pow, Serge. Well, what would he say if he saw you like this? Well, he'd say pow. You got it, Buster. <laughs> you guys are the best. Okay, let's do this! Wait, no, not this time. This is Lose the Weight with your fitness host, John Tron. Get fit now, not later! Hi, it's me, John Tron. And this is my fitness experience. I'm non-accredited, 
unqualified, and you should only listen to me at your own risk. You know my motto? Why lose your big old gut through proper diet, exercise, and perseverance when you can lose the weight and lose the weight. We live in a fast-paced age, which means we need a fast-paced workout to match. We may never be able to destroy obesity the same way we did Iraq in 2003, but it doesn't mean we can't try. For profit! Follow my moves, everyone. Uh-oh, forgot to turn off push notifications. I don't even know, what the hell is this, Bank of America? I don't want that. The write-off, and slash those business expenses. Woo, didn't that feel good? This is OJ's favorite move. The timeline scroll, come on, we've all been here. Uh, you'd think with seven billion people, there'd be more worthwhile things to read, huh? Shut up, Janet. Shut up, Ryan. I'm not following your cat on Instagram. It's, it's not a person. Swiping for love. Girls, a little more discreet, huh? Left, left, right. Left, left, right. Guys, ah! I don't know why, I just don't feel right. I don't feel, I feel bad. What's, I just don't know what I'm gonna do with my life. Here. Yeah, uh, mean you can buy these tapes and more for the low price of $19.95. Lose the Way it is now available on Laserdisc, HD DVD, USB Drive, this guy who just tells you what happens, and the Pirate Bay. Also, don't snooze on this limited time offer to buy our patent pending workout apparel for 20% off. That narrator was lying about most of that, except the last part, which is true, and I'll be explaining in just a moment. That's right, this video was sponsored by the wonderful people over at Honey. Honey is legitimately the easiest way to save money online, and if you don't use it, you're just doing it wrong. If you don't know what Honey is or what it does, it's basically magic. It's an add-on to your browser that's constantly scanning the web for deals you could be getting on any given website, so when you're about to check out on some items you're buying, it'll pop up and let you know you could be getting a better deal. You just hit apply coupons and let Honey do its thing. It automatically applies every promo code it can find until it lets you know you've got the best price on the web. Just in case you don't believe me, I actually do use this app myself and just two of my most recent bounties are Queen VIP tickets to a show at Medieval Times for basically the same price or less than a regular ticket. Uh, and of course, more relatably, when I was trying to buy my 42,000 BTU commercial air conditioning unit, I saved a whopping $273.83. Cause you know, nobody wants to overpay for industrial cooling. The point is, it worked for me and it will for you too. Downloading it's easy, it's free and only takes two clicks to install. Also, very specially, for the next two weeks, anyone who downloads Honey for free at my link joinhoney.com slash jontron gets 20% off all my merchandise over at represent.com. And that includes these brand new, super sweet, limited edition prints of gnomes, baby. That's right, they're only around for two weeks, so get them while supplies last. And if that weren't enough, I'm signing the first hundred of each. And I'd sign these too. Also, you can grab this awesome shirt, among other things, so head over now. Okay, that's all for me. I'll see you guys on the next episode of What the Hell Am I Doing With My Life? I can't even get my fat ass through here.